M0 FXP, welcome back to my drone videos. The plan today is to get my Avata 1 and fly it alongside my Neo. The Neo, I won't even use the remote. I'm going to do it, let it just follow me. I've got the Integra goggles. There's a USB connect adapter there, as you can see. Uh, and then it goes down and that's going to my smartphone, okay? And I'm allowing all the updates to happen now. So it's all happening just here. As soon as you connect, you get all the prompts. I wanna update the RC2. Now it's a real shame we can't use the RC2 with our Neo, but that's okay. I mean, maybe one day I'll upgrade to the Avata 2, but I just feel like the the Neo has ushered in a whole new generation of drones with a lot more autonomous features. Um, so I'm just holding on. Uh, I don't, and also the thing about the the Avata One, it's just so good. It, it's just so rugged, and I, and I, I I feel confident flying it, especially with my RC Motion. So anyway, as you can see there, downloading, I'll let it do the goggles, then we're, I could connect it all to the PC actually, um, but I'll let it do the goggles, I'll let it do the drone, the motion, and then we're going to have a little fly, uh, with the, I'll try and get these, these two flying side by side, of course they're, it's half the size, and half, I mean, it feels like half the weight. Uh, why is everyone buying the Neo? Well, it's £169, and you can just press a button and it'll follow you. So why not? I mean, why, why, it's just an excellent, such an excellent idea. And I can fly that one with my RC2, which is here, and my RC, um, it's N3, I believe, that came in the kit. I have used it. It's quite good. Works well. I mean, if DJI let, allow us to use Integra and Goggles too, I think there'd be a lot, a lot of happy DJI owners and a lot more would go out and buy the Neo. So thanks for watching my, my drone videos. Ultimately, I am a ham radio operator who just has an interest in drones. 7.3, bye for now.